Stay! What's going on? Sorry? What's this problem? Stay! No idea. Sorry I'm late. The alarm clock never went off. Can't fool us. What was he like? What? Obviously worth staying in bed for. You winding me up? No. I spent a quarter of an hour knocking on your door. No one sleeps for a racket like that. Yeah, well I did, all right? Billy, can you go and do some work here? Go and check the fuse box. There's something wrong with the lights. Watch you up. Yeah, mate. Listen, uh, thanks for opening up, mate. Look, you can shoot off home now if you like. I, I can handle things from here. Will you? What's that supposed to mean? Well, you say you're going to do something, Steve, but I don't know if it actually happened, do I? No, hang on a minute. I overslept. Again? This morning only one off, is it? Well, is it? I'm serious, Steve. This goes on for much longer and one of us will be looking for a new job. Listen, mate, I, I won't deny it. I I've been through a rough time recently, all right? But that's in the past now. Believe me, I am not about to let this club fail. Ugh. Billy! Billy! What? What have you done? Nothing, honest. Yes, yeah, so what's happened? I, I don't know, everything in the fuse box looks all right. But there's some more candles down there. Bring them over here, will you? This could take all day to get this fixed. Look, there's no point in the three of us hanging around here. Why don't you go home, eh? That's a lot. All right, leave him there, and then you can get on the phone. Who am I ringing? The electrician. Got the phone book's in the office. Hey, and check with me first before you agree to anything, all right? I'm about to pay some massive call-out charge unless I have to. Okay. Hey, go on, I, I mean it, you, you should go home. Huh? Come on, I can sort everything out here. I promise. Come on, you've got to trust me. See you later. Yeah, certainly will. No, look, I'm sorry, that is just not good enough. I need an appointment with my own doctor. <sighs> Thank you. Yeah, no, that's fine, yeah. I could take the whole day off if need be. Well, as soon as there's a cancellation. Fantastic. Yeah, look, I understand. I'll be there. quotes you wanted, but the earliest anyone will come out is half three. Steve? Yeah, I'd say the sleeping's definitely getting better. Yeah, I just need another week or two, you know. Help me catch up properly. And you feel that a repeat prescription would help you to do that? Oh yeah, of course. When we last met, I prescribed you a month's supply of tranquilizers. That's right, isn't it? Well, if that's what you seems there. In that case, perhaps you should explain to me how it is that you managed to get through the entire course in only two weeks. Don't know how else to get this through to you. They are too weak, which is why they're not working. Mr. Owen, what I am suggesting is that you have begun to build up a tolerance towards this drug. No, it's not that. And the only way you could have done that is by ignoring the warnings and self-prescribing. Now, I agreed to this course of medication on the understanding that you were going through a short period of sleeplessness. Yep. Billy. <clears throat> no, mate, no. I will deal with it, okay? Yes, not now. Look, just leave it to me. Yeah. However, under the circumstances, 
I really don't feel that I can issue a repeat prescription. I hear what you're saying. You know, I suppose if I'm honest, I just didn't realise. Sticking to the right dose is vital, Mr. Owen. Over the years I've seen dozens of people become addicted to tranquilizers. Yeah, well, I'm not going to be one of those if that's what you're saying. It's a fine line between taking a tranquilizer to help you to sleep and taking one because you can't function without it. I know, I know. It's, you know, it was just that first week. I mean, really, I, I was so tired. I mean, the only thing I could think about was getting me a down. And now? Oh, things have definitely got better. I guess I just need some help with the last few days. A couple of weeks, right? And what you're saying, that to do the trick. If not, make another appointment and we'll, we'll talk again. Well, thanks. I appreciate it. Stick to the prescribed dose, and I think you should find that things continue to improve. Great. Uh, Mr. Owen, no more than one tablet at any one time. Start taking a larger dose, and you put both your physical and your mental health in serious jeopardy. I understand. Boss reckons he's got it covered, so it shouldn't be too much longer now, love. I'm just popping out for a bit. Got a bit of important business in there. You just carry on, yeah? Where is he? Hey? Eh? Billy! Billy! What? Why don't my tea? Why aren't the lights working? I don't know. Why aren't the lights working? What, you being funny? What? Are you thinking this is some kind of joke, do you? You, you said you was getting it sorted on the phone. Don't worry, Bill, you said. Leave it to me, mate. That was your exact words. Before you knew what you was doing. Uh, you get on the phone. You get on the phone, you ring every electrician in that book. I want someone out here tonight. Now, Billy! Okay. But I'll tell you something, though. I ain't taking the blame for this one. I only did what you told me. Cheers, lads. A bit of luck, we'll be out in the game tomorrow. Come on, mate, no cheers. Oh, it's shut. Well, what does it look like? Oh, I'm not surprised. I heard this club was rubbish anyway. Well, you just live round here to annoy me, do you? None of my mates would be seen dead in there. None of your mates would be old enough to get in there in the first place. Yeah. Right, what's this? What's this? Huh? I'm sorry. Don't even bother. Look, I thought Billy was going to sort out the lights. It wasn't Billy's responsibility. I know, but by the time I realised he hadn't, it was too late. Billy is not my partner. What's all this about trust, eh? Not letting the club fail. I made a mistake. Too right you did. Do you know how much we're going to lose tonight? You know how much it's going to cost us? Pay, I square it with you, all right? How can you? You can't even get out of bed on time. I can't turn my back without you messing up. I'm sorry. Look, I'm not up to this right now. We'll have to talk tomorrow. Steve!
straight. 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 You can't keep landing in the city. You can't keep walking away. Your problem is, mate, but you better get yourself sorted fast. 